Hi guys, it is Tuesday, May the 5th, and we are going to be talking today in my tip for the day about an adaptive skill. Um, usually on Tuesdays I talk about fine motor, and this you could make it to a fine motor activity as well. But we've talked a lot about fine motor skills, and I know that they get kind of repetitive, but I've given you lots of suggestions on those as far as tearing paper and playing with Play-Doh and using your scissor skills, stringing beads or cereal or um, just anything like that that you can do with your hand, getting outside and playing with your sidewalk chalk or your bubbles. So anyway... Since this is the last week I was going to be providing new content, I had a couple of um, different activities that I wanted to touch on, and I was running out of time. So, anyway, we've talked about reviewing information such as your first and last name, whether or not you're a boy or a girl, um, and how old you are. I've also mentioned parents reviewing things like, what's your birthday? What's your address? Where do you go to school? Maybe what your mom's first name is or your dad's first name. Um, all those sorts of things are good things to work on knowing. Um, so the other thing that I wanted to touch on today that I had seen actually, um, someone had posted this on Facebook, but it had to do with learning your phone number. And if you wanted to combine this into a fine motor activity, let me get one of my numbers off the floor. You could take one of your numbers, this is the number seven, and you could cut um, seven circles, seven squares, you could glue seven pieces of cereal onto the page and do that with each number. Because what I've done is I have done the numbers like you would see on a phone screen. 1 through 10, which 10, of course, is that 0. I think you can see it up here at the top. So um, the other way that I had seen this presented was the person had used paper plates and had put the plates on a wall. So I was trying to think about things though, that I had on hand. I actually didn't have any paper plates, so I had paper. But what I want you to do, parents and child, is work on learning your phone number. So for me, my phone number is 7062606308. That's my phone number. So however you have to do it, parents, if you have to mark the number somehow on this, um, mark the 7, mark the 0, mark the 6, but have your child work on learning one phone number. I know we all have different phone numbers, maybe one for mom, one for dad, one for grandma, all that, but it would be helpful for your child to know yours. So anyway, I thought that was kind of a cool activity, a good way to work on that skill. And like I said, you could even put those pieces of paper or those plates on a wall, just whatever works for you. So anyway, that was my tip for today. You could work on that fine motor skill by drawing numbers or cutting out something or finding little beans or pieces of cereal to correspond with the number. Just be creative. So it's not like these um, skills exist in isolation. You can do self-help and motor at the same time, which is kind of this activity for today. So anyway, that's my tip for today. I hope you have a terrific Tuesday. Bye-bye.